And now it's time for the main event. Jay Lethal versus Mark Briscoe. Ian and Caprice joined it. Uh, come and do the announcing along with Excalibur. So, um... I mean, the review of this whole segment just basically comes down to uh, Mark Briscoe. If you're listening, you are a hero, and I'm not saying that because he came out here, you flew to Kentucky, and you had a great match because you've been doing that for 20 years. That's just a normal Wednesday for you at this point. I am saying that because with everything Mark has uh, been through in the past week, he comes out here, and you can see before the match starts, and then especially at the end when everyone's out on the apron, everyone there wanted to be there for him, but it absolutely totally went the other way and he ended up supporting everyone else and uh i hope that if i am ever in a tragic situation like this i can carry myself with the dignity and the grace and the courage and the bravery bravery of mark briscoe good luck dude i know i I said hope (laughs) holy smokes this guy yeah this guy came out and i talked about this last night he's wrestled all over the world for 25 years. But he has never, ever had a match for WWE or AEW on national cable television, mm-hmm. live in front of a million people. And man, this dude came out and man, he wrestled this match like he'd been in this company on national TV yeah. since like the Attitude Era. I mean, he was great. He was great. In this match. And man, poor Jay Lethal is the one who's in tears. Oh, yeah. He's crying through this whole match. Mark's trying to carry him and keep his spirits up. While beating his ass. And they <laughs> they just like pummeled each other. Mm-hmm. And the fans. The thing is, you know, the fans were going to be in this match because of the circumstances. Yeah. Okay? Mm-hmm. But if you watch the match, like there, there would be the, you know, Briscoe chance. Let's go, Briscoe. Thank you, Tony. They did all of that stuff. But these two guys were so good in the ring that the fans were going crazy for the match. Yeah. They were into the match. They were into the spots. They were into the story. It was hard hitting. The wrestling was great. They teased the table, teased the table. Oh, it- and then Mark does his froggy elbow off the post through the table. Uh-huh. The place is going crazy. One, one table spot in the entire match. And then a guy who's never wrestled for AEW, paying tribute to his brother who's never wrestled for AEW, starts teasing his brother's finish. Yeah. Which is you you hook the guy. He could be hooking him for anything. But the moment he hooks that, these fans know, oh my God, he's going for the J-Driller. Yes. And they start doing counters off this move that's never been seen on AEW TV. Yeah. And the fans are into the counters back and forth. And Manny finally hoists him up and he plants this guy in his head and he pins him. And they went nuts. They went nuts because of what it was and also because of what a great match it was. Yes. And Mark's got both belts. He's got his brother's belt because Jay is still one half of the Ring of Honor Tag Team Champions. And he's out there and he goes up and everybody comes out on the ramp. And they're all crying, and Mark's hugging everybody, and he is holding everybody together. Yes! And he holds those belts up, and the, everyone's cheered, and the show goes off the air. And I have never, I don't know if I've ever been so happy and immediately so angry as when I saw the end of this awesome, oh yeah, yeah. awesome show. This awesome tribute yeah. to an awesome family with an awesome guy wrestling another awesome guy. And a bunch of awesome guys and women out there on the stage. And man, they cut away to slap fighting. Yeah. I'm like, come on. Yeah. I could not, God. I could not delete that part fast And enough. then apparently the slap fighting rating is sky high. So now I've totally lost faith in humanity. I see. I've totally just given up. Well, yeah. Uh, the, the, the match was tremendous. The fundamentals were great. You know, the Briscoes have this rep as, as, as totally out of control brawlers, which they certainly can do. Uh, but they're they're great wrestlers, and uh, there's a couple of things you can do when you have a trademark move to get the most out of it. Obviously, the Jay, Jay Driller they teased it three or four times, and Jay Lethal had a different counter every single time. If I tell Mark finally hit it and won. The other thing you can do is you have a guy hit his move, but then the second time he goes for it, he has now gone to the well too many times. The other guy has a counter ready. 
And uh, Mark did that when he did the, the neck breaker, that da 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 neck breaker that, 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 that Jay used to do. Um, he hit it the first time. Second time he tried it, lethal at a counter. But then it happened with lethal the same way. Lethal, I think it was lethal. It was lethal, the lethal injection or lethal combination. Either way, he hit it the first time. But when he tried it again, Mark was ready to have a counter for it. So tremendous wrestling match. They did exactly one hardcore spot and got the absolute most out how to do that one table bit. And uh, Jay wins. And his first thought is to go to the camera, shout encouragement to his family to keep their heads up, tell Jamin he loves him. And uh, we didn't mention when, when, when Lethal came, came out, it's Lethal and Santi walking on a stage. And if you ever watch the show, they're just complete bastards every week. And unlikable bastards, that whiny loser bastards. But they come out here and they're practically sobbing, the two of them. And uh, Jay Lethal, after the match, his back to the camera. Right? I think he just completely broke down as he was making his way up the ramp. And uh, Mark, you know, carries uh, the burden of the company and the morale of the locker room and his family like a king. And he's up on there hugging everyone, leader of men. Uh, 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 keeping these guys' spirits up and keeping their heads up. And uh, the the if you haven't seen it, there's a uh, on Caprice Coleman's Twitter feed. It's Caprice and Mark hanging out at the airport the next day and the morning after at home. And uh, yeah. Mark giving lessons and wisdom about how he's getting through this. And uh, um, you know it's it, 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 it's obviously a deep subject and uh, it's, it's a very you know heavy religious and faith based and not everyone's religion is you know lines up and there's a lot of different ways to view that but but if if, if you're going if you're if you're grieving right now and you're having a hard time dealing with it um look to mark briscoe and look to this speech and i hope you can find a little peace that way this guy's awesome yeah. show was great mm -hmm. fabulous show poor steffi every time she comes out she gets poor steffi all right yeah any anyway she, her and her dad were in the in the ring, and he was oh, going to give gonna her. It's going to be quite a review a, tonight. He was going to give her a trophy for something. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the good old days. And then uh, Shane tells his dad he wants to run Monday Night Raw. <laughs> this is insane. Meanwhile, right. there's gigantic news in the world of wrestling that we're not talking about because we got to talk about a Raw from 25 years ago. Yes, Granny? Can I stay long enough to hear what the news is? I know what it is. Well, we don't know what the news is officially, Granny, so just tune in tomorrow. No. What a crummy show. Oh. Wow. What do you want me to do about it? What the? <laughs> if you enjoy these videos for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm. The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.